Jimmy, please say something. James? What? Who are you? Mom, I thought you told me never to talk to strangers. Like I said before, Jimmy, please be nice to your new stepfather. Okay, rich guy. I love it that you're twice as old as my grandfather and you're fat and bald. Uh. That's enough! I've had it with you, you little brat! You've upset your mother. I've got half a mind to beat you. Half a mind is right. Suddenly he realizes. I can't believe you, you little monster. We'll deal with you when we get back from our honeymoon next year. Boy, Bullworth Academy. Have fun, Jimmy. I'll think of you from our cruise ship. <laughs> Whatever. Mom, why'd you marry that phony? What is wrong with you? Oh, I can't believe this. You must be the huh? Hopkins boy. Where'd you come from? We've been expecting you. Welcome to Bullworth Academy. Ah. I'm sure you'll be very happy here. Very happy indeed. Anyway, I can't spend my life waiting around for naughty little boys. I've got a man to make happy. The headmaster is expecting you, Hopkins, in his study. Okay. His study is over there, boy, in the main building. Don't keep Dr. Crabblesnitch waiting. He's a brilliant man. Brilliant. I didn't mean anything. You're a I just can't stand her. Look who got hit oh, with the ugly today, pal. Lose your head. This, room this guy fell on my head. I don't think I'd feel any worse. If I don't get that those day, my mom will be so disappointed. So, you must be Hopkins. Uh, uh-huh. What? Uh-huh. What? I meant yes, sir. Very good. Now, let me see. You've done a lot of naughty things, haven't you? Vandalism, graffiti, bad language, violent conduct, disrespecting staff. Oh, I'm scared of you, Hopkins. Come on, give me a break. Yes, I've never met a boy like you. Never in all my life. Hopkins, you're quite the nastiest little boy I have ever encountered. Tell me, why should I waste my time on you? I don't know. Because it's my calling. It's what I do. You excel at causing trouble, and I excel at fixing little boys like you, at making you into respectable members of our community here at the Academy. I've got a good feeling about you, boy, a feeling you and I are going to be great friends. You keep that nose clean, boy or I shall clean it myself. Miss Danvers, are you back yet? Yes, Headmaster. And I got your tea. You are good to me, Miss Danvers. No more than you deserve, Headmaster. Take our new friend Hopkins here and show him around the school and get him properly attired. Certainly, Headmaster. Come along, boy. I haven't got all day. And boy, remember, you will have a clean nose. 
So keep it clean, or we'll clean it for you. So here I am at probably the worst school in the country, whose alumni are nothing but arms dealers, serial killers, and corporate lawyers. Real scum. And that old creep thinks he can tame me? We shall see, my friend. I only give people what they have coming to them. Where's your uniform, young Hopkins? Run along now, child. Why do I get so nervous around boys? I wonder. I wish I could do something here. Yeah. Whatever you way, say, boys. I don't like Later. you. What time it is? Yep, time for a beatdown. Get the new kid. Beat him down. Go! Go! Young man, go change immediately. Ah, oh, come on. Hey, you're the new kid. Yeah, what's it to you? Friendly, aren't you? Give me a break, loser. Hey, relax, friend. You're all pent up. Go easy or they put you on medication. They did to me. Boy, you nearly sent me insane. That's fascinating. Now if you'll excuse I me. I said relax, friend. Get off, man. Listen to me, tough guy. You just arrived at the toughest school in the country, and I'm offering to be your friend. Trust me, in a place like this, you're gonna need friends. So it's up to you. You gonna play nice or what? Yeah, sure. Good. So how about I show you around? We don't have a don't bar like in the you. door, just a soda machine. I wonder if girls will ever like me. This you should probably change into your uniform if you don't want to get in trouble. Nice. Hey, how you doing? You must be the new kid. I'm Pete. Pete Kowalski. Jimmy Hopkins, and don't ask how I'm doing. I've been here five minutes, and already people want me dead. Even my parents didn't hate me this quickly. Well, welcome to Bullworth. It's a dump. Great. I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent. Yeah, I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent, because I'm really bad. Give up the tough guy act, pal. Hey, man, what's your problem? Well, ADD primarily, but also life. My parents, this school, Western civilization, but really, honestly, enough about me. Oh, I see you've met the dorm's mascot. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Femboy, the girliest boy in school. Petey, haven't you got some imaginary friends to go annoy? Why don't you leave me alone, Gary? <laughs> Look at you. Leave me alone, Gary. I'm really self-important now that I finally hit puberty. What's your problem? I'm just being nice to the new kid as he passes through Bullworth on his inevitable journey to prison. Look, I gotta unpack. Would you guys mind getting out of here? <laughs> oh, now look what you've done, Pete. Jimmy can't stand you already. Hello. How's it look? <laughs> I'll do anything you want. Please don't hurt me. Check this out, sucker. Hold on anyone yet today. I hate this. Condiments are just so disgusting, you know? Especially mayonnaise. Yeah. Oh, I'm no. really. Hey, Jimmy. Oh, that's Let me 
show you around. That's Russell's locker. You know, the big ape who almost put you in the hospital. Word stupid! Pulverizing good! Please let me off the hook. Time to pay your Russell tax! I don't deserve this, please. Puny ant! You don't know what pain is! This dusty nut! Not to smash you! Come on! Let's break into it and steal something. That'll teach him. Careful around the prefects. They don't have much of a sense of humor. Jimmy. No need for complex for you. Hey, actually boy, kissed her. Let's go to the cast. I'll show you who's who. Feeding time at the zoo. Okay, here's the deal. Over there, we got the nerds. Of course, they're complete social outcasts. They look pretty harmless. They're actually sneaky bastards. Their turf is the library. And those are the preps. They're all money and condescending attitudes. Yeah, massively inbred and completely brainless. Very observant, Jimmy boy. Now, over there are the greasers. They think they're tough. Or at least try to look tough. Wouldn't advise messing with them, at least not yet. They hang by the auto shop. And last but not least, the jocks. These guys rule the school. Definitely avoid them. Whatever, I'm not afraid of some dumb roid monkeys. You'll learn. Come on, let's go. You're here to learn, not to goof off. Get to class. Just like that. Loser! I know I'm forgetting to do something today. What are you doing in here? Oh, right. 
Take care to follow my instructions precisely, as we will be working with volatile chemicals today. Fascinating, isn't it? Very good. Carry on. Good work. You have a future in chemistry. You may have a future ahead of you, young man. I'm getting good at this. That's that nonsense dealt with. Someone keeps breaking into the door. I don't hear the pressure very well. Fudge blaster! Can't believe it! Funny pants! Gosh! You seem to be making yourself quite comfortable here, my boy. I'm just trying to fit in. By fighting? By making a nuisance of yourself? That is not the Bullworth way, boy. Yeah, you could have fooled me. What? I said you could have fooled me. This place is full of bullies and maniacs. Nonsense. That's just school spirit. Hijinks. Why, in my day, we felt nothing of castrating the new boys. I want you to stop this nonsense, Hopkins. I want you to behave yourself. You might learn something. Fine. Can I go now, sir? On your way. Hey, I saw you sucking up to Crabble Snitch. What? Shut up! Screw you, new kid! This is what we do to teachers' pets around here. You better not- Ow! <laughs> come here, you little- Yeah, come and get me! How do you like a little slingshot, a tough guy? I'm sure he was just kidding when he called me annoying. I hope I get it. You're a bad person!
How you doing? Talk What's down, Delio, you dude? You, like You'll have to try harder than that. You true as disgust me. You should be in class now. Hello, class. The curriculum demands that you do these vocabulary uh, assignments. Why don't you finish them here in class? That way you'll have more free time. Try again, James. Keep it up! Good show! That's right! That has to be some sort of slang, yes? Good one! I'm afraid that's not English. I don't think that's in the dictionary. That has to be some sort of slang, yes? That's right! Good show! Keep it up! I'm afraid that's not English. Well done! Done. I can't help but wonder how you do with a more challenging curriculum. Russell smashed him good! Russell smashed, stupid face! Please, don't hurt me! <laughs> stupid! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Jimmy Hopkins. Another job well done. I sometimes feel like it's just not worth it, you know? Well, later, alligator. You do the world a favor and kill yourself. I'm worried that I'm not participating enough in class. Man, you probably don't even play like Grottos and Gremlins. So that's a good idea, right? Yeah, okay. All right, sure. I'll do it. <laughs> Hey, man, what's going on? Not much. I was just telling Petey here about my idea to take over the school. I mean, my plan for us 
to take over the school. What plan? Don't worry, Jimmy. It's just a little something I came up with. It's sink or swim, my friend. And if you're good at swimming, you gotta let the losers drown. Why don't you guys leave the thinking up to me? What? What? What, what the? Can't you say anything else? <laughs> you know what, Petey, you were right. Jimmy is pretty dumb. What'd you say about me? Whoa, nothing, no, no, no. All I said was that you had to be pretty dumb to get expelled from so many schools, that's all. <laughs> Relax, James. All he said was that you must be dumb. Or maybe you're all messed up because you came from a broken home. What'd you say about me, dwarf? Come on, dude, chill. No, 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 no. Gary's taking everything out of context, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't lie, Petey. Don't you lie. Because you know what happens to liars? No, no, I'm not lying. We kick them in the balls! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Jimmy, let's go see how good you are with this new slingshot I heard you had. Don't worry, friend. Nothing escapes my notice. I hear everything. You and me, we can do things. Hey, Jimmy, follow me. I know I'm a good kisser. I've practiced for years on my own. You want to get seriously hurt? I don't understand why the kids at Bullhorn can't be as nice as the teachers. Can you hit them with a slingshot? Collect this. Come on, punk. Let's rock. I despise weak people. Oh, so you're gonna start fighting, punk? I'm gonna give you something to tell your therapist. You're pathetic.
a career out there for me. Make lots of money and don't have to think. Gotta get out of this place. Got a present it's a for you. Kid, huh? Everyone is talking about you. Oh, are they? And what are they saying? Uh, nothing. Just that you're friends with that sociopath Gary. Socio what? Sociopath. It means. Never mind. Forget I said anything. I need you to help me. Wait. You need me to help you? I've got some library books that need to be returned, but I'm too scared to go to my locker. Do I look like a librarian? No, listen. I need your help. Pretend we're friends. Walk with me. I'll pay. <laughs> I'll pay you two bucks. Two bucks? Are you crazy? Make it five. No. Two bucks? Great. Five bucks. Let's go, buddy. <laughs> I've been thinking a lot about snails recently. They're slimy. Do you really have to pee when you get nervous? Hey, Algernon. What's his problem? You want to play games? Let's play games. Stop! This is great. We hit hard out here. Help me! I'll break him in, boys. Draw him in a body chunk. Help! Are you hurting me yet? Stop the school. Get this help! Like, uh, that's all you got. Uh, I hate those don't lie there and cry like a girl. Hurt him! Make him cry! once this month. If I do it again, they'll never let me hear the end of it. You! What is the meaning of this? I can't go I in there. I won't quit That's until you are caught. teacher. Tell them I was nasty to you. Shut up, Gary. You're such a jerk, man. Oh, am I, Petey? Oh, you're so cutting. I'm really upset. Actually, I think I'm gonna go cry. Then I'd be just like you. Cry, little girl. Oh, look out. <laughs> Here comes Jimmy. Just knock it off, Gary. You're out of line. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize I was hanging out in the girls' dorm. Silly me. Shut up, man. You're boring. Boring? I'm boring. You're none too interesting yourself, friend. <laughs> mm. 
Look, I'm sorry, both of you. I apologize, okay? I just get a little overexcited. Forgive me. Forget it. It's cool. Anyway, I've got a good idea for some fun. Let's go out and torment someone really helpless and unfortunate. That homeless guy. <laughs> come on. You coming, little Petey? Come on, I'm sorry. I'll give you a kiss if that's what you want. Shut up. Then come on. This is gonna be fun! Harassing some old homeless guy is fun? It is. Call me and you should be grateful you're not the victim for once. I guess. Hey, Jimmy, tell me about this guy. Does he like to go in his own pants? You look like Come someone here. who can get all trouble. Where is this dirty old perv? You know, you're not very nice, Gary. And you're a loser, Petey. One of life's unfortunates. Get out of here, you little scum! <laughs> <laughs> so I guess the rumors are true, Jimmy. Your dad does live Shut on campus. Up. You jerk! Ow! Let's leave this guy to his welfare payments. Come on, let's get out of here. Just get out of here, kid. Why should I? Because otherwise I'll kill you. What's your problem? <laughs> That's a long story. You got any liquor? No, I'm 15. Well, what about drugs? No. Then why shouldn't I kill you? All right then, tough guy, kill me. <laughs> you know what, kid? I like your style. You got guts. When I was on that ridge in Korea, watching my buddies get killed by friendly fire, I could have used somebody like you. Yeah? Thanks. But I bet you can't fight. You do me a favor, and I'll show you some real moves. Classified moves. Real special army stuff. Cool. Just get me a part for my radio, and I'll show you what the army taught me. What, like how to get shot by your own side? Exactly. You're gonna wish you had a bodyguard. Look at the pit okay. we go. You wanna get beat down? Stop. Get you, you, or I'll hit you harder when I get you. What have we here? You want some of me here? Are you looking for a rumble? Because I'm all behind you. You're a complete waste of time. Ever been to a one door tournament? Thanks, kid. You're one of the good ones. Transistor when you come back. Done and done right. Mr. Galloway says I got talent. He says I can go all the way. I can't wait to get out of this place.
This school needs more discipline. You know, Lola, she's really hot and actually talked to me the other day. I think maybe she wants to be my girlfriend or something. Do you really have to pee when you get nervous? I do. I get nervous a lot. You wet your bed again. You can't mess with me. Just love it when someone wants to be with someone who isn't me. You got it. I really, 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 really have to go. What's his problem? You wanna play games? once this month. If I do it again, they'll never let me hear the end of it. I can't go in there. That's for girls. Yo, get to class. Go, go, class for starting. He's so dreamy. Full word spirit. Maybe I should do sports or something. Just look down. Don't make eye contact with anyone. Please, nobody hurt me today. I wonder if I can skip this year. Everyone at Bullworth is mean. Ain't no stopping Jimmy Hopkins. 
Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Miss Phillips, and it is my pleasure to induct you into the world of arts. certainly captured my character. Very talented. Hey, want to help me with my homework? Hi there! I got something for you. Jimmy, you're so nice to me! Alright, let's do it. Watch and learn, suckers! That's it? Or what? Or, well, just give it back! Are you threatening uh, me, Metal Mouse? No, I just, just give it back! You can't just steal things from me! <laughs> Unfortunately for you, my pig ugly friend, that is exactly what I can do. In fact, I can do anything I like in this place. Anything at all. Chow spotty. Give it back! And you should stay out of the girl's dorm, you little perv. Ugh, I see you undressing me with your eyes, sicko. You wish. Please, will you help me? Do I have to? Yes, it's vital. She's stolen my lab notes. Without them, I'm gonna fail chemistry and I'll never get into med school. Now I won't find the cure for cancer. Basically, the future of the whole world rests on those notes. What's in it for me? Well, if you get them back, I'll... I'll kiss you. Oh, uh, that's okay. Oh, well, okay, but... If you don't, I'll tell the whole school you're some kind of sad sicko who spies on girls getting changed in their dorm. Relax. One set of lab notes coming up. Hey, Gary. I need to get something from Mandy's locker. I'm not surprised. You know, you should put a stink bomb in there. It'd be funny. Get one from Fatty. He knows everything about stinking.
keep this. I wonder what everyone is talking about. I don't care what they think of me. New kid! lessons or something. It's time for some wrestling instruction. This rule will require physical contact between you and your opponent. Don't any of you enjoy it? The strongest boys in all the land. Please, I have nervous bowels. My mom oh, still thinks I'm a winner. I heard him. I have so many years ahead of me. So Don't do it. I shall maim thee. You don't want to touch me. My smell is contagious. <laughs> I have so many years ahead of me. Don't do it. Hey.
a doofus! I shall maim thee! Come on, boys! Show me what you got! With me. It would be nice if hey. you showed your interest in me nice. by presenting me with a gift of some kind. Leave Ever ridden a real fight? Okay, Jimmy, here's the plan. No problem. Thanks. I have to stay focused if I'm going to get that academic scholarship. I hope Dr. Crabblesnitch doesn't forget about me. I'll be a cardiovascular. Much obliged. That was easy. Hey, sweet cheeks. Your trousers are kind of flattering. Hey, girl. Your trousers are kind of flattering. And how does this stay find you? My so eyes are you... getting tired. No. I need to take my glasses off, so I need to be alone. Excuse me. Are you up yet? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. Get out. Stop, Gary. I'm trying to watch this. Ah, swim team. Intellectual stuff. So tell me, Petey, do you Come like on. watching the girls in their swimming costumes? Does get, that fuel your filthy little. Hey, just get out of the way. Oh, Marion, show me your breaststroke again. Or. Wait, do you like the boys on the team? Yeah, right, Gary. Which is it, Petey? I see you guys are getting along as usual. I'm just toughening Ow. him up. Ow. Turning him into a man or a woman or something. Hey, hey, Petey. Ah, pea stain. Good to see you. Listen, Jimmy, I need a favor. Bucky went to the auto shop to get some parts for his science projects. He hasn't come back yet. I think he might be in trouble. Please? Why don't you go yourself? I've got homework. <laughs> okay, I'm frightened. And I've got a weak bladder. Oh, I think the bullies might have gotten him. Please, I'll pay. I say do it. It's a good dance to show Russell who's in charge around here. Now run along, Ow! Peace Stain, before you mark the carpet. Yes. We've got to take care of Russell and his boys. Then, after that, take care of all the other cliques. Soon, this school will be ours. I don't want the school. Yeah, well, I do, pal, and I intend to get it. Now go help that door. And what are you gonna do? I've got planning to do. Knock it off. Mm -hmm. Stop. Uh, sorry. Is that 
pathetic loser. I'm not a pathetic loser. I'm so, so bored. I wish something would happen. Gotta get new sheets again. Oh, what are you on? Get fucking... <gasps> You like that train? Ha! It was a tiger, not a up. crane. Having fun? You can see your skin. Wise choice. Nice to know there's a violent, crazy old man on campus. Thanks, Timmy. That's great. Here, take this. Job well done. I heard that crazy old man. Sigh.